attack of the game. Royal Guard, destroy blue eyes! Let's check out the animation. This will finish you! Final animated attack. Royal Guard destroying a blue eyes white dragon. I believe that this will be the final attack of the game. Goodbye, Blue Eyes. Please tell me Kaiba was it. <laughs> Don't think you'll get away with this. I will get my revenge, Yugi. God damn it. More characters talked about how they want rematches. It makes me worry that there's going to be yet another area. Just full of more rematches. I lost my most powerful capsule monster, my strongest servant. My strategy was flawless. I had the exact capsule monsters I needed to win, but still, I lost. Kaiba, I may have won this time, but our skill levels are exactly the same. Ah, is this some pathetic attempt to console me? If it is, then you can stop right now! No, I just know how tough you really are. Huh, I lost this battle. But I don't have to listen to you running off at the mouth! You listen to me, Yugi. Our fight is far from over! Right. We'll meet again, Kaiba. Okay, Royal Guard levels up to two. Hmm. All right. And nothing leveled up from all that experience there. I'm going to take his two blue eyes and whatever his most powerful monster is. Destroy a golem. Because fuck you, it's Kaiba. I got to take his blue eyes. I don't care if I already have one. King's Coliseum clear. You've done it. What have I done? The title, King of Capsule Monsters, is yours and yours alone. I'm gonna cut out my reading if there's a voice saying all this shit. Keep the glory and pride within your heart. We want you to continue challenging yourself in game battles. This concludes the Capsule Monster Battle Tournament. but the road of Capsule Monster Battles can be as long as you want it to be. Here's the future battles. Huh, the only Yu-Gi-Oh! game where they actually encourage you to keep playing after the credits. The rest just kind of pretty much acted like you would keep playing after it. This one kind of encourages you to keep playing after it. And... Yay! Credits! No more of the game! This game is finished. I would like to thank whoever the hell it was that requested this game. I'm sorry, I forgot your username. It's been so long. Um... But yeah, you requested it. I actually went out and got it. I don't remember exactly how much I got. I probably stated at the beginning of this playthrough how much it was. Damn, Ed Paul played a lot of characters. Um, yeah, 
it, this game is actually pretty fun, honestly. It's very creative. Um, and that final battle is probably my favorite out of any Yu-Gi-Oh game. I swear, it, it, it's just perfect. Because it lets you, it lets loose of everything. You know, anything that you kind of felt, may have felt like constricted by before, like monster points, AP, or whatever. It's no longer an issue when you're in the final duel against Kaiba. And I was glad that the final duel was against Kaiba and not against just some random villain that we really didn't even know existed until the very end of the game. Um, but yeah. So this is a fun game. I'd recommend it to any fan of Yu-Gi-Oh, honestly. I mean, if you if you've played a bunch of Yu-Gi-Oh games, but you want something you know that feels really different, something you haven't experienced before, you know, and is actually fun and challenging, uh, definitely check this one out if you haven't, and also check out Duels of the Roses because that one's also pretty different. Although this one is really different because it doesn't even have spells or traps in this one. Um, would I put this? On my top five card battle games, probably not considering I don't consider this a card battle game. Honestly, this this is more like chess and shit. You know, I hear a lot of people would probably say they put this on there. This 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 isn't really cards. You're not dealing with cards here. You just get a bunch of chess pieces and there you go. So yeah, I think this is like the only you. Well, no, yeah, no, wait. Yeah, I'm pretty, is this the only Yu-Gi-Oh game that really can't, you wouldn't really put under card battles? I mean, I know there's Yu-Gi-Oh 5D's Stardust Accelerator, or whatever that one is on the Wii, where it's basically Yu-Gi-Oh mixed with Mario Kart. Um, don't know if you'd really count that one. I know there's also Dungeon Dice Monsters on the Game Boy Advance. Uh, I don't know. But yeah, if you want to see me do more Yu-Gi-Oh games, I've got plenty that I haven't Let's Played yet. Um, I recently picked up a Yu-Gi-Oh 5Ds game that will probably be showing off in a game collection soon. And stuff like that, I've... I need to... I got a Yu that Yu-Gi-Oh for Mid Memories on the PlayStation. And a bunch of other stuff. Looks like it's the end of the credits. Is there anything post-credits? Just the, uh, oh, clear bonus. Congratulations on completing campaign mode. You will receive this monster as a symbol of your achievement. So we get Fortress Whale, Rigrass Lever, and Javelin Beetle. Keep up the good work with Capsule Monster Coliseum. Huh. Is there a way to get other monsters than just those three? One error. So yeah, let's see how long did it take us to beat the full game. Sixteen hours and two minutes with twelve seconds. So yeah, this is a pretty lengthy game, honestly. So yeah, it's pretty fun, and you definitely get your money's worth if, as long as you're not paying like sixty bucks or something, which I don't think you was a PS2 game. So yeah, is there anything like if I load up my save file? What can I do? What happens if I load up my save file? Let's see. there's any extra shit. Because again, I played through this entire game blind and I loved it. No, it just starts you all over. Okay then, um, at least that's what it looks like. Yeah, it just starts you over. I'm guessing it's like New Game Plus. Um, although I highly doubt anyone will be e even more difficult. You just kind of can go through the whole game with the monsters you've already won. So, yeah, that's kind of cool. So, yeah. I'll see you guys with the next Let's Play. I hope you enjoy it. Uh, my next Let's Play will be over a game that is just coming out. It's coming out very soon. That's why I rushed through all these Yu-Gi-Oh! videos and whatnot. So, yeah. I hope you guys will enjoy that Let's Play. I hope you guys will enjoy Zack and Wiki in future Let's Plays that I do in the, you know, in the future. So, see you guys in the next playthrough.
Bye-bye.